Valley Township. In O and T O U R County W B R E slash W A O U all of the escaped monkeys from Friday night's crash are now accounted for, but public health concerns remain. Michelle Fallon of Danville says she concerned for her health after coming into close contact with one of the monkeys on the side of the interstate. Fallon says she never could have imagined that trying to be a good Samaritan would lead to this. She just received her first dose of rabies vaccine and a round of antiviral medication, after a monkey hissed in her face at the scene of crash in Valley Township. I thought I was just doing the right thing by helping. I had no idea it would turn out this way," said Fallon. Fallon says on Friday she saw a truck hauling the trailer collide with a dump truck where Route 50 for meets Interstate 80. She pulled over to help the driver just as if his trailer was okay. He never said, if you do come near the crate do not touch it. If he would have told me that, I would have been more careful. That's when Callan came face to face with an agitated monkey. The truck was hauling 100 Sinomal Goose macaque monkeys from Africa, headed to a lab in Missouri for testing. The three monkeys that escaped have since been recovered. But during the search, officials warned the public not to come near the monkeys because they could transmit disease. I was close to the monkeys. I touched the crates. I walked through their feces so I was very close. So I called to inquire, you know, was I safe?